はこんばんちは。ムンちゃんだよ。Let's learn Japanese with me. Today's katakana are たちつてと How to read them? たたちちつてて、と、と。Here's how to write them. First letter is た。Let's write like the guide. One, finish with fade stroke. Two, fade stroke. Three. Stop. This is ta. Chi. One. Fade stroke. Two. Stop. Three. Fade stroke. This is chi. Next is tsu. One. Let's draw the line like the short hand of the clock hitting 11 o'clock. Stop. Two. Stop. Three. Play the stroke. Even this letter could be recognized as katakana, so make sure to write those lines almost vertically. Then next is te. One, stop. Two, stop. Three, fade stroke. This is te. Then to. One. Stop. Two. Stop. This is to. So when do you use katakana? Katakana is used in following categories. Borrowed words. Such as piano, juice, and names of foreign places. For example, Thai, America. Also, names of foreign people. For example, Steve Jobs, animals, plants. Some are written in hiragana or kanji. For example, lion and onomatopoeia. For example, nya. Other than those, if you wanna use the specific word impressively in your written sentence, you could express it using katakana, like this. Don't you think katakana is cool? Then let's learn katakana words with Ghibli animes. Ta, Shita. Shita is her name. Chi, cheese, cheese. Cup. Cup. This t is written in small katakana t. With this small t, you would pronounce it like cup. Cup. 
in this case top and if you write this in normal size you'd read this katsu te table table Totoro. Now let's review the lesson. Now can you read this? This is ta. Then can you read this? This is tsu. Then what's this? This is te. Then can you read this? This is to. Then what's this? This is chi. New vocabulary. Taiya. Taiya. Tsuna. Tsuna. Team. Team. Test. Test. Tomato. Tomato. This is it for today. See you. You did great today. If you wanna learn katakana more, check the left one. And if you wanna learn kanji, check the right one. Bye.